Hello and welcome. One of the more important pieces of information you aren't shown in the default Windows interface is what percentage of the CPU is in use at any given time. If you are using Windows Vista or 7, you could use a CPU gadget for the Windows sidebar. But I don't like to use the Windows sidebar as it gets in the way and is much larger than it needs to be. To see what the processor is up to, you can bring up the Windows Task Manager by right-clicking on the taskbar and selecting Start Task Manager. Once the Task Manager is open, click on the Performance tab. Under the heading CPU Usage History, you will see each physical processing core represented, along with a graph showing the percentage of utilization for each. To the left, under CPU Usage, it will show a bar graph showing the total percentage of utilization for all of the cores combined. Now that the task manager is open, if you look down by the clock in the system tray, you'll now see a small square representing the total CPU usage. Let's click on the Minimize button. Now that the task manager is minimized, we still have the CPU usage icon in the system tray. But unfortunately, we also have an icon showing that the task manager is running on the taskbar. We need to set task manager to not show an icon in the taskbar. Click the icon representing task manager to maximize it. To keep the task manager icon from showing up in the taskbar, click in the options menu. and click to select Hide When Minimized. Now when we click the Minimize Task Manager, the icon showing the CPU usage is still in the system tray, but we don't see the icon showing that Task Manager is running on the taskbar. Now we have the CPU usage monitor in the system tray. But who wants to go through this each time they reboot their computer? Click on the Windows Start button. All Programs. Accessories. And then Windows Explorer. The Windows Explorer window will open. Navigate to Computer. Local Disk C. Windows, System32, and click on the folder to select System32. Now on the right side, scroll down and find taskmgr.exe. Right click on taskmgr.exe and select Create Shortcut. It will create a shortcut named taskmgr.exe-shortcut directly underneath. Let's rename it something a little better. Right-click on the shortcut and select Rename. Enter Windows Task Manager for the name. and press enter. Now let's close down the CPU monitor. If we double click on the file, we will see that it opens Windows Task Manager. And if we minimize it, it will stay in the system tray. We want to set this so that when this shortcut is run at startup, it opens to the system tray and does not open so we can see the application window. Right-click on the shortcut and select Properties. Change to the Shortcut tab if not already there. Next to where it says Run, change it from Normal Window to Minimized. Click the OK button to save changes and close the window. Now if we close Task Manager from the System tray and double-click on the Windows Task Manager shortcut we created, it will open directly to the system tray. 
and there will be no icon in the taskbar. Now we need to take this shortcut and place it in the Windows Startup folder for all users. By placing this shortcut in the Startup folder, every time the computer reboots, the CPU monitor will appear by the clock in the system tray. Right-click on the Windows Task Manager shortcut and select Cut. Now click the Windows Start button, then All Programs, scroll down to Startup, Notice the folder is empty. Right-click and select Open All Users. Right-click in the folder that opens and select Paste. Now if we click back on the Windows Start button again, All Programs. Under Startup, we now have Windows Task Manager. It is possible that you might not see the Task Manager icon in the system tray. If you don't see it, then click on the Show Hidden Icons button and then the Customize link. The Notification Area Icons window will open. Here is where you select what shows up in the system tray and when. Find Windows Task Manager in the list and ensure that Show Icon and Notifications is selected in the dropdown. Then click the OK button to save changes. Now just reboot your computer to test out and verify that the task manager is opening to the system tray. Now if you are wondering how hard your computer is working, you can just glance down by the clock and see your CPU usage.